Hello again, YouTube, and I'm back with another video here. And this video is for those folks that may be uh, kind of wondering exactly, you know, what my system can do as far as in terms of using this ultra capacitor battery bank, or I'm sorry, ultra capacitor bank in addition to uh, my battery bank when my system is off grid. And right now, uh, this particular inverter, this Connex SW4024, is in uh, hybrid mode. And I'm pulling in a lot, it's uh, a lot of amps coming from solar. <clears throat> and as a matter of fact, there's about a positive uh, 12 or 13 amps going to the battery bank. Now, this is, I'm gonna show you my system in action as far as, you know, household loads. Okay, YouTube, here we see that my uh, washer is actually, you know, I'm washing clothes right now. Um, it's in one of those high efficiency washers. And uh, you know that takes some amperage, so uh, so I'm, I'm I'm doing laundry, okay, for lack of a better term, I'm doing laundry. All right, I have this ceiling fan. The ceiling fan is going, and I've just turned on some lights and stuff like that, so that's going as well. Okay, YouTube, and as you can see here, I'm actually doing uh, the dishes at the same time. So the dishes, uh, so I'm, I'm doing the dishes, and uh, you can see I have another ceiling fan going. Um, with the lights on and I have my that you have that big television there and a big computer uh, Sitting right next to it. That's driving that television So that's another thing that I've got turned on just to kind of illustrate the power of using those ultra capacitors and why I have them in place Okay, you two now if you look here You'll see that I'm pulling about 36 amps coming from the battery bank itself so what that means is um, obviously I'm pulling a lot more amps than, um, you know, I'm pulling a whole lot more amps than 38 amps. So my solar is actually, because this thing is in hybrid mode, my solar is kicking in and so only about around 38, about around 40 amps was coming from the battery bank. So with all of that being said, okay, I'm pulling a whole bunch of loads, all right? And so with these ultra capacitors, this ultra capacitor bank, um, you know, in place, um, I'm able to run a lot of things at the same time. So that's what I'm saying. That's what, you know, one of the reasons why I'm, I'm saying that my ultra capacitor bank is, you know, that's why it provides a lot of power when I need it. And I can run more things than, you know, than the average household through a standard inverter. Yes, this inverter has a nice surge capacity and everything, um, and it does very, very well on its own. But this right here is just, it, you know, it just it sweetens the pie, so to speak. And as you can see, I'm, you know, it's pulling, I'm pulling about around 40 some volts, 40, uh, 40, 40 amps, over 40 amps coming from the battery bank, 80% uh, uh, state of charge, and my battery bank, as far as voltage, is down to 26.2. Um, and so, um, you know, you can see what I got going into my charge controller. It's an alarm because it's, you know, it, it, if it ever goes above that, the amperage rating, like right now it's at 60.5, so it kind of goes into an alarm. So I'm pulling, I'm maxed out on my charge controller at 60 amps. And you can look at the midnight and see that I'm also, I'm pulling about 36 amps. Uh, coming in from my other sources so if you add both of those together it's like you know right around 96 amps coming in from my solar and uh, and I'm pulling in addition to that so if you say 96 and I'm pulling about 30 amps coming from my battery bank so I'm about just you know almost 140 amps you know all you know coming uh, you know supplying power to the loads in my home uh, so you know that's why you know this thing here it works great I wouldn't trade it um, so I mean when the power is out you know or things happen uh, I you know I don't know the difference if I go off grid I, I truly don't know the difference um, because you know I could run whatever I want I can turn on the microwave now if I wanted to um, just to kind of let you know turn on the microwave turn on another television as a matter of fact I've got like you know three or four at least one two three computers going um, right now uh, and again I don't do this on a normal day-to-day -day, but I just wanted to kind of illustrate this 
uh, for you folks that were wondering about, okay, what's the big deal with these ultra capacitors and what did he really truly get, you know, gain from it? And I just wanted to demonstrate because there were some folks that had some questions. And so I just wanted to demonstrate this is what I can do uh, with my ultra capacitors in addition to my, my particular off-grid system. Um, the battery bank um, has, is doing very well. You know, both, both banks combined into one. You can see that I've got them on both. And, you know, obviously, you know, even now you can see that I'm about, right now I'm about 150, 100 and uh, roughly, 100, almost 160 amps going to my household loads, but only, only about 60 amps are coming from my battery bank. That is no joke. Um, these wires here, you know, these are four all, uh, cables. They can handle that all day long. So I'm not really worried about that at all. Um, so, man, you can see it's climbing. All right, okay. And so my uh, inverter here, like I said, there's a lot of, uh, there's a screaming going on. But the thing is, it's, it's maxed out. This is exactly what, you know, it's supposed to be doing. And this is why I bought it. That was it. That's why I bought the thing because I need this thing to really, really put in, pull in the, uh, the amps. And this is, and this is also why I bought the, uh, the midnight because I also need it to be pulling in amps. And this, you know, 37 amps coming in battery at state of charge at 87 percent. So it's doing exactly what both systems are working in tandem with each other, and they're doing exactly what I need it to do. Okay. All right. Take care, YouTube, and uh, if you have any questions, any comments, or whatever, you know, feel free, um, and I'll try to answer them to the best of my ability. All right.